Hey, what's up YouTube? Waterfowler2012 here. Thanks for clicking on the video. Um, got some new toys. And uh, since uh, me and my dog are just chilling out here and the wife is uh, out and the baby is out, figured I'd make a video while it's quiet. What do you think, Bernie? Hmm? What do you think, buddy? You're a good audience. Are you interested in what I'm doing? Well, that's good. <laughs> At least I got one person that will watch this video. Alright, guys. Uh, so, <clears throat> I wanted to get some new Spidey Blades. I have uh, enjoyed the, uh, the little bug pack. Uh, I have the little bug on my keychain and use the grasshopper and the honeybee um, and the dragonfly too, which I like a lot. So I kind of wanted to expand my inventory of Spider Spiderco blades. So what two did I get? All right, here we go, guys. The most reviewed blade on YouTube: Spiderco Tenacious. Yep, got that guy. And what other one did I get? Da, da, da. The Endora 4. Okay, so of course I've already taken these out and I've been playing with these guys. So as far as the Tenacious goes, um, the one thing with these blades is uh, they seem a little tight to me. And I guess these, uh, I, they break in a little better as we go along, I assume. Um, so that's basically uh, the Tenacious. Um, I actually thought the grip on there would be a little better, um, but I'm still playing with it. This would be probably the largest EDC blade that I would carry. Um, I really like smaller EDC blades, and uh, this just is a lot larger than I would normally carry. But I am having fun with it, and uh, for the $30 or whatever I spent on it, I'm just, uh, you know, getting used to it, hoping that uh, I will, you know, get a good, a lot of good years of use out of this blade. So, <clears throat> the other blade that I got, I would not EDC. This one seems a lot larger to me, and uh, I got the Endora 4 in gray. And uh, I really like the texturing on the handles. Um, and again, I'm not a real big knife guy, but I'm learning. Um, there you go. This I bought specifically just for cleaning geese and ducks and breasting them out. Um, I really like this blade um, shape and design. And I think that this, this is going to be... A perfect blade for breasting birds. I was going to get uh, a Delica, uh, which I think is a smaller blade than this one, but I really like this, and it is razor sharp. I mean, from the manufacturer, I was shaving with it uh, on my hands the other day, and it is just really, really sharp. Um, so, very, very happy with this so far. Um, and I've only been playing with it a few days. This is the VG10 steel. And it is just super, super sharp. So, um, yeah, I do like this. Uh, and I think for the purpose I bought it for, again, I'm probably never going to EDC this blade. Um, but <clears throat> it is nice for the purpose that I bought it for. I'm just probably going to throw it in my hunting bag. And uh, we'll be able to, you know, breast out birds um, when the season comes. And hopefully I can get out and hunt a little bit. So, that is the reason I got this blade. And, you know, it is a lot larger than the Tenacious, I believe. Um, especially when the blades are out. Put it on the table. Um, but yeah, these are really tight. And I'm, I'm hoping that uh, hoping that these will loosen up. And I'm sure you Spiderco guys out there will tell me that they are, uh, or that they will 
loosen up a little bit. But yeah, as you can see, the Endora definitely is a lot longer blade um, than the uh, than the Tenacious. So these are my new toys. Um, hoping to get some use out of them, maybe do review down the road of each of these blades. Probably not the Tenacious, just because everybody on YouTube has basically reviewed that blade in detail. But maybe the Endora. Um, four. I may do a review on that and maybe even breast out some birds uh, with it on, uh, on, a, on a video in the future. Alright guys, thanks for watching and as always, if you're not into preparedness, you're preparing to fail. Mm -hmm.